Hi guys, I am back here again to talk to you about more of our new stoneware glazes. Here we have Antique Brass. Antique Brass is a matte metallic gold glaze. This glaze does not have a whole lot of variation that happens with it. Um, primarily, the it, once you have two to three coat, good coats on, you're going to have just a consistent brass kind of gold color. Um, and the less glaze that you have on, you're just going to have a matte black finish. So there's not a whole lot of variation that happens with the glaze, but you ha do have this nice, consistent brass metallic finish um, with three coats of application. This glaze, you don't have to worry about movement or anything like that when it is fired to cone six. Um, so you can go all the way down to the bottom of your piece with three coats to get that nice brass finish on the whole entire piece and you don't need to worry about it moving or anything of that nature. This glaze is the only glaze in our new stonework glaze release that we are not considering dinnerware safe. Um, it does pass our AP certified food safe testing, but we are not putting it in the dinnerware safe category due to the fired surface. It's not totally chemically durable, so we do not recommend it to be used on uh, surfaces that come into contact with food. Um, it's fine on other functional wear like faces or obviously decorative pieces. So that's um, totally fine for you there. Um, all of these pieces that you see here are fired to cone six. As with all of our stoneware glazes, they have a firing, re firing range from cone five to cone 10. Uh, the cone 10 results are listed on the label. This glaze looks really, really nice at cone 10. It gets a little bit more matte but the gold has a little more, some more variation with it. It's kind of a more sparkly, really, really metallic gold. Um, and, and it's going to move a little bit more at that temperature. So definitely check the label for our cone 10 results. Again, we have it in our uh, stoneware brochure and on our website. If you want to see images of any of those, it's a really, really useful tool to have. So please uh, drop any comments that you have or any questions that you have in the comments below. I would love to answer them for you guys. And definitely please check out your nearest Mako distributor to pick up your new pint of glaze. All right, guys, take care.